Oh, cool, you made the pinwheels for the 4th of July thing. Ken, they're not pinwheels. They're patriotic propellers. <laughs> Hi, and welcome to Crafts by Two. I'm George. And I'm Ken. And we made patriotic propellers, otherwise known as pinwheels. And I've been wanting to make them for the 4th of July, but we went all over and I couldn't find any kind of paper that I liked, 4th of July-y paper. Especially double-sided. Yeah. So, we created our own paper. We made Craft by Two digital paper. And that's what these are made of. Stars and stripes. We have two types of papers. The traditional and the crayon version. So we have crayon stars and regular traditional stars. Then we have crayon stripes and regular stripes on the other side. They're two-sided. Isn't it great? But they're two-sided because when we printed them out, we printed them out two-sided. So you can mix and match the patterns however you want. Yep. That's what makes them so cool. So we designed these on our computer and we just printed them out on our printer with white cardstock in it. We have a printer that prints full pages, edge-to-edge -edge printing. So if you have a printer like that, you can do papers like this. Even if you don't, it'll just leave a border around the edge, and you can just trim that off with your paper trimmer, and then you can make cool pinwheels like those. I meant patriotic propellers. So we're going to make these patterns available online to our Patreon supporters. So we're going to have 8.5 by 11, like you see here, and 12 by 12 versions of these Stars and Stripes patterns. We're also throwing in another pattern that we don't have printed out here that has blue and white stars across the top and then the red stripes down the side. And that's going to be a simple stars and stripe pattern. And we're going to make that available on 8.5x11 and 12x12 for our Patreons also. But we're going to put the 8.5x11 version of that up for anyone on our website. Just read the description below and follow the link. So in our other video, we showed you how to put the pinwheels together with the We Are Memory Keepers Pinwheel Maker. And Ken made pinwheels on a Cricut. They didn't come out that well. But I got a surprise for you, Ken. What? I made a patriotic propeller for you on the Cricut. I just used the We Are Memory Keeper accessory to make it into a fully functional pinwheel. And I combined the Stars and Stripes paper and the Crayon Stars and Stripes paper to make a huge pinwheel on the 12x12 12 12 pattern. That's cool. And some hologram paper. Yeah, that was cool too. That was just kind of sitting in the corner and I thought, oh, that's great for 4th of July. Too bad we can't print out hologram paper. Hmm. So we're going to show you how we made this pinwheel from the Cricut cutouts. So here's the pinwheels that we cut out on the Cricut with our new customized papers. I'm going to show you how you can use the We Are Memory Keeper pinwheel attachment with them. So first, let's put the pinwheel attachment together. Slide this part on. That way it has something to spin on. And then we're going to put these. on to the end. And I didn't do a very good job of guesstimating the hole size when I put it on. So it's big enough for the little peg, but not for the big peg. So I'm just going to push it firmly through all the way down to the base, like that. And flip it over, and then you're going to put these at a 45 degree angle to each other. And then you're going to flip that behind the one behind it. So you have access to all these. And then you're going to go around putting them on one at a time. And again, it's going to be a little hard because I didn't estimate the size right. up. Just push the last one out. There. 
Then it comes with an end cap, and you put the end cap right on. Oop! <laughs> the paper's in the way. There we go. And then you can pull them forward a little bit and spread them out some more. And then on the back, put the stick in. And we used a gray stick, so it lets the red, white, and blue stick out better. And then the last thing I did was made this to put in the center. So I'm just going to use a tape runner to put some adhesive down and stick it on the center post. There we go. Our finished Cricut made pinwheel. That's all there was to it with the Cricut cutouts. It was easy. Just as easy as the We Are Memory Keeper punch board. But it's the accessories that make the difference. Yep, accessories make it spin cool and turn it into a patriotic propeller. So we'll have a link to our other video doing the pinwheel comparison in our description. Plus, we'll probably put a little card over here or something. Yeah, around here. <laughs> and we'll also have a link to the accessory kit on Amazon so you can check them out for yourself. So this is just the first of our series of 4th of July decorations. Make some for the kids, make some to make a bouquet with to decorate the house, and bring them to the parades and the fireworks. People will love them. You'll be the envy of the neighborhood. So until next Tuesday, or probably sooner, we'll talk to you later. Bye. Bye. Oh, oh, and remember, they're not pinwheels. They're patriotic propellers. Rrm, rrm, rrm. Oh, cool, you made the pro propellers. You made the propellers. I told you. And then you make couple. But we're gonna put the eight and a half on the left. I made a patriotic. Ready? So first, let's put the wind pin.